Hi everyone, it's Rebecca Bly from Live Beyond the Mat. I saw something going on in class today that I wanted to take a brief moment to talk about. It's the difference between lateral extension and lateral flexion and how that affects your triangle pose. If you have no idea what I'm talking about, then you're in the right place. So let's zoom out and briefly take a look. Uh so I'm gonna start by standing up close so you can see everything that's going on. We've got lots of patterns. I picked this horizontal striped shirt to hopefully illustrate what we're talking about today. So we mentioned about uh, lateral flexion versus lateral extension. So the first one, lateral flexion, means when I hold still from the waist down and I take side bends. You might have heard this category of poses in yoga called side bending poses, right? You'll see them a lot when we take our arms up overhead and go to the side. Each time I move this way, I'm creating wrinkles in this side of the body, right? My spine is actually making a curve, right? So you can kind of see on the shirt how all the lines are coming together here. So that's different from lateral extension where the shape of our spine stays relatively straight as we move to the side. Now the hinges from that are not the waistline. You don't bend from the waist like you would for side bends. They actually come from the creases of the hips. I'm gonna take a step back. So for instance, if we were to prepare for triangle pose, I take my feet wide apart and I'm gonna turn on one heel to point that foot forward. So in order to find lateral extension instead of flexion, I'm gonna to have to tilt tilt, 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 tilt through my pelvis. You're gonna feel a big pull on your leg here, right? And I'm trying to move my body into that, again, lateral extension, tilting through the pelvis in order to come into my triangle pose. So again, what I'm seeing sometimes in class is that people are holding steady from their waistline down and taking a side flexion instead of extension, right? Bending from the waistline. Now, it feels really nice, right? And there are other times in class where we might work this kind of way, but in triangle pose, you're kind of missing out if you're losing that tilt, right? We wanna get into that tilt so we can find extension through the spine and really find the benefits of the pose. So that's my quick story today about lateral extension versus flexion. You can always send me an email and ask me a question, and I hope to see you soon on the mat.